guys. <laughs> you ready for the big leagues? Yeah, we've been ready for a while. Uh, but, um, yeah, one more game here. Wrist feeling good? Yeah, it feels great. It's been feeling great for weeks, and i um, yeah, just excited about, about playing again. There have been reports out there that said you needed about 50 to 70 at bats before coming back. It's, that's just not true at all? I'm somewhere around 40. I don't know. Uh, no, I'll get, I'll get the other uh, 10 to 20 in the big leagues. What did you guys feel like you needed to accomplish here that you couldn't accomplish in extended spring? <laughs> uh, I think it's just, you know, you got you go up to another level and, you know, but a lot of those guys are just babies, you know, they're just coming fresh and, you know, some guys here are a little more polished and can command uh, pitches a little better, so you kind of want to see that. So um, I think that's the basic idea that the team wants you to do is go up and get some at-bats against guys that have been around a little bit and, and can command pitches. Was it nice, Kevin, for you to come back to somewhere you're kind of familiar with, though? Uh, yeah, it's always, uh, you never want to always come back to the minor leagues for uh, you know, any reason. But uh, if you're going to come back, uh, it's always cool uh, to come back to the places that you, uh, you know, played when you were younger and, and just to you know, travel to the big leagues. And uh, you know, I had a great time here and a short little stint. But uh, you know, for me, uh, it brings back a lot of good memories. How much has this place changed in about the was it 11 years since you've been here? Uh, you know, they, there's a couple renovations that are, you know, different, but, uh, you know, walking out to the dugout in the dungeon, uh, <laughs> you know, that's still the same, but, uh, no, it's great, uh, you can actually see the batter's eye now, uh, that's the, that's probably the best part is, we always used to fight with the old general manager about trying to get the signs to be not white, <laughs> it was tough to see, but it, it's great, I mean, it's, a they've, they've redone the locker room, the weight room and stuff for the guys, so it, it's definitely uh, it's, it's stepped it up a notch. Would you say the back's at 100 percent, or is it? I mean, it's better. Yeah. But is it? It's back to where it was when the season started. Oh uh, yeah, it's going good and uh, moving around and just uh, you know, for me, uh, every day it's just I got a maintenance program that I do every day and it takes a good half an hour and I think that's uh, going to help me uh, for the long haul is sticking to that program and you know as long as I keep doing that the, the exercises that I'm supposed to do, I think I'll be good. Kevin, how about the line drive feeling you had earlier in the game? Uh, it's good. Uh, you know, I'm just glad uh, I caught the ball. I didn't mess up. Mark, did uh, you talk to Brian or Joe? Did they say you definitely would be playing Friday night? That's questions for him. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we brought him along with us today. Texas, you, you know you were the RBI player of the game. Had some pressure on you today. If you got a, if you if you get an RBI, they would have gotten ice cream. Oh, now you tell me. <laughs> you lost him game of protection. What do you expect? <laughs> That's my fault. I didn't get him third. <laughs> How did the at bats feel in general? Good. I mean, you know, we've we've taken a lot of at bats, um, and uh, I mean, nothing special. We didn't we didn't really <laughs> do much today, but um, it's all about about health. About health, you know, health, seeing pitches. That's important. Uh, try to see as many pitches as you can in your at bats, and uh, I think we both did that. Yeah, no one comes down to spring training to watch us. We only had one reporter. We got a lot of at bats, so yeah, we we got we, we faced a lot of pitching. Yeah, so I mean, it's, I mean, he's probably as close to fifty at bats as anyone. I probably had thirty at bats myself. Was it strange at all coming out at ten thirty in the morning? I mean, what, what did that do to your routine? Well, we've been we've been playing ten o'clock games in Florida, so uh, we're ready for it now, as ready as we're going to be. <laughs> so, is the night game tomorrow going to be a little throw off? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> it's I mean, big league season is travel and the, you know the game times. It, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. Tex, you had long at bats. I mean. Just seeing pitches, how yeah, much does that that's, mean? That's really important. Um, I mean, you, you want to make sure your swing is really good in BP. You want to make sure that there's no pain. Um, if you swing and miss, which I did today, there's no pain. I had some check swings down in, in Florida, no pain. No issues at all. And so now you really just want to see pitches and make sure that, that you're, uh, you're getting as many at-bats as, can, as you can and um, you know, help the team out when you get to the big leagues. Mark, have you been batting both on the right and left-hand side, and which one has been feeling better? It, at the it's always, I'm always uh, further along right-handed, um, <coughs> and I get less slumps right-handed, but that's just because it's my natural side.
I asked both of you guys, know what's here about, you never know when your last game's going to be played, uh, you know, aside from predicting your own retirement or anything else. Is, is it too corny to suggest that being out as long as both of you have, that there's a renewed appreciation of getting back out there and enjoying baseball? Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not close to playing my last game. <laughs> <laughs> we got a lot of games to play this season, so... Uh, no, it's good. It's good to, you know, it's, for us, it's, I, I can't speak for myself, I can only speak and say that it's, it's good just to, to know you're healthy and to go out on the field and uh, just getting games, you know, being around guys and, you know, for us, we, it was a little different for us than the games we played down there. I mean, we, we played five innings and we hit every inning. So we ran out the field, got our helmets and went and played. So, I mean, it was definitely a lot, but uh, it's kind of cool here to kind of, you know, get to sit down, relax, and get the actual atmosphere of a ball game and see what happens in front of you. So I think that really helps out too in kind of getting used to doing that again. I mean, we we were hitting every inning, so it's like, you know, it, it didn't really feel like a baseball game. Yeah, we're in shape too. I mean, <laughs> you get in good shape down there. Yankee offense has been kind of flat the last couple of nights. You guys extra anxious to get back because you can see that you're going to make some, make some impact? I've been anxious to get back since the day I got hurt. So that, that hasn't changed. Um, yeah, we definitely want to score more runs. I mean, since I've been here, uh, I think we've been one, one or two every year in, in runs scored in the major leagues. Uh, we're not there right now. So, um, you know, Kevin and I aren't going to do it by ourselves. No one, no one ever does. But it's, hopefully it'll be nice to, to get back in the lineup and, and score some more runs, absolutely. What can you say about the way that your, your, uh, your fill-ins have fared in your guys' absence? Especially, especially you with uh, with uh, David Adams the last month or so. Have you seen what he's done in the big leagues, and did you expect that of him? How much did you know of him from spring training? I, I didn't know David at all. So, you know, I'm new here. There's a lot of guys that are new to me um, in the system, but he's done a great job, and um, I know he's had. I've, he's also had some back issues in his past, and I think he's over that hurdle. So it's, you know, it's good for him uh, that he's healthy and on the field and playing well because uh, – not even just playing well, just being able to play. Just I've, I've heard a lot about his injuries, so it's always good when you see guys like that that come back and they're healthy and playing, and it's a good feeling. So, you know, for me, uh, seeing it, you don't win a, a World Series by just 25 guys there. I mean, guys are going to get injured, guys are going to fill in, and um, there's going to be trades and all kinds of things that happen. And I've played on World Series teams and seen a lot of crazy things. So uh, you just got to be. That's what being a teammate is: is, is not you know being selfish and and enjoying watching all the guys that are going to help out and win. How important is tomorrow for you guys to kind of go through a full day with BP and infield and all that? Is kind of uh, more important than, than today? No, we like I said, we haven't been, you know, sitting on the couch for the last right. three weeks. We've been down in Florida working every single day. I think you know, we've each had one day off where we didn't come in and, and work out. So, uh, you know, we're ready. Has it helped kind of having each other as you both go through this rehab process? Absolutely. Um, Kevin and I have known each other since uh, college and, and minor leagues a long time ago. So it's uh, it's fun to to have somebody that you've, you've known for a long time, played against Kevin for a long time. And um, we, we enjoyed ourselves down in Tampa as much as we could. Which one of you bought spread today? Uh, we're, buy, we're equally buying them yeah. on both days, so right down the middle. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Is that all, everybody? All right, thanks, guys. All right.